bad stuff happening in the world, how are we gonna fix it? Each one of you, I will assign today a specific job as to how we're gonna make the world a better place. McKenna, you're in charge of taking shopping carts at malls and putting them back to where they go. Did you think they had a good time? Like, did you think you yeah. got through to them? I, I think I really got through to them. I, I think people were having a blast in there. I love talking to them. I love connecting with them. I, and I feel like I, I made a lasting impact on them. It was kind of boring. I thought David was going to be here. I was here for David. I thought he'd be thinner in person. What's up guys, welcome to today's video. Um, we had so much fun at VidCon, and uh, we're back now, I have no voice. I saw Scotty's show last night, which was really cool. And then uh, before that, we had um, a, an amazing um, Q&A with everybody from the Vlog Squad. And that was like really great, it was like 16 of us on stage. And um, yeah, it was just like really great to all be together. I was like so glad I did that. Um, so yeah, I just wanna thank you guys for your support, it was really cool to go to VidCon this year and see everybody and I shouldn't even be talking because of my voice. I also have a really big announcement coming up. I'm gonna be doing 10 fall tour dates, uh, stand-up comedy dates all over the country. Um, so I'll be announcing those really soon. Okay, well, enjoy today's video. I'm sorry my voice is gone. All right, bye. Hey, guys, we're at VidCon. How are you? I know I sound depressed, but the truth is I just went running and I've done two days in a row. I'm very proud of myself. And here's John. We have Ro from Collab in the back. What's up? What's up? And we're going over to a panel, and we're in a really nice SUV. And the nicest part of VidCon are these SUVs. <laughs> it's imagine being hot. You're hot outside. You're only outside for 30 seconds, and you're already hot. And then you get in here, and it's nice and quiet, and no one's vlogging. So now we're doing a panel. Am I the only one on the panel? Yeah, it's a creator chat. Oh, it's just me? Yeah, it's just you. Oh no. You think anyone's even gonna come? I think probably. I think a couple people will come if they're not busy. At 11:30. Using the or, you know, <laughs> sleeping. Okay, guys. Well, we're gonna do a creator chat by myself. <laughs> oh, I'm so sore. Make sure I got everything. Sam Elliott, how you doing, Sam Elliott? How you doing, Sam Elliott? Hi, Sam Elliott. Good morning, everybody. Morning, morning. How you doing? Oh, this is nice. Look at this back end. This is great. How you feeling, man? You're about well, to go to your first I'm panel. I'm really nervous. I didn't know Katie Morton was going to be here. <laughs> so now I've really got to up my game. I hope you're pre prepared. Turn on question. my intellectual side. She just starts psychoanalyzing you during the chat. <laughs> I start crying. <laughs> I break it down. <laughs> Are you guys twins? No, we're not. She's a sister. We're always together. Wow, this is crazy. <laughs> Jack. Oh, this one? Oh, I'm not in this panel. We got bad stuff happening in the world, how are we gonna fix it? Each one of you, I will assign today a specific job as to how we're gonna make the world a better place. McKenna, you're in charge of taking shopping carts at malls and putting them back to where they go. <laughs> Got it? Ash, I want you to make sure I don't eat too much cookies at night. Okay, get it. Faith, get it. <laughs> TV. You talk to Faith. <laughs> Figure it out. Michael. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Get more cool shirts like that from Quicksilver. What are, you, what are your goals with YouTube? Are you all here to have fun? Are you here to make money? Are you here to quit your day job? What's it all about? Okay, so I guess, yeah, if, if I'm trying to think, like if I was in your shoes, I would want to know, like, this is what I would want to know. How do I make money? How do I, you know, like make this a job? Is that, is that what everybody's here for? That's what everybody wants to know, right? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's so hard to tell somebody like, oh, do this or do that. I mean, there's like the stock answers, like post every day, um, do stuff you're passionate about. Um, but I think the main thing is just like, you have, you just, you really, 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 really have to love it. And you have to go to a place that is beyond anything that you could comprehend in your mind in terms of comfort, in terms of uh, sacrifice, go, go beyond to the point of like, if you, if you were to think of like Michael Phelps and you were to like look at what he did in a day, 
you know, or Floyd Mayweather. He runs seven miles a day, he trains for four hours a day. You, you literally have to go to that place. For me, the thing that makes me happiest um, is, is making videos, editing them, and posting them. I, that, that's what makes me happiest. How do you keep motivated? Because I'm exhausted just like seeing your world. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, <laughs> I, I have two kids that yeah. I, like, I, I that I just think about all the time, and they motivate me to work really hard. Okay. And um, and I'm also motivated by um, I'm motivated by like a really good piece of footage. You know what I mean? Like mm -hmm. um, we were at the we were at the movies the other day, and um, and we got something really great. You know, we didn't know we were gonna get it, and then afterwards, you know, you, you like feel good. Yeah. You're like, oh, cool, that was funny, you know, and then it goes away and you feel like, but, <laughs> but it lasts for a little while. In the world of like content creation, is say you have one topic, what if you wanted to switch uh, subjects of your videos? Like, right. you know, say if you're a gamer and you want to make like cooking videos like that, right. that's pretty drastic, but, but how, how would you try to do that without risking losing your audience? Mm. That's a great question, um, I, and I might be answering it poorly, but this is what I would say. I would say, like, if I, if I know you're gaming and I like you, I'm like, oh, that dude's funny, like, he's a cool gamer. And then one day you came out with a cooking video, I'd be like, oh, sweet. Like, because we're, we're all multi-dimensional human beings. Like, we, especially, like, in this day and age, we, we all have, like, five things that we do, right? We do a million things. So, like, I say, I say throw everything that you do. It's all about watching you in that situation. That's why, that's why ideas on YouTube, like people redo ideas, like I'm gonna smash your pass or I'm gonna let the person order in front of me for 20, 24 hours. It doesn't, the idea doesn't matter. It's just watching you in the situation. So if you wanna make a cooking video, I think that's great. I think the more you can show people, the more that you do, the more you show your, like if you can show your grandmother, if you can show the people at Hobby Lobby, like that's what I do. I, do, I show people everything. Like this is my daughter, this is, this is why she's so amazing. Um, I showed people, one time, this is gonna sound so stupid, but one time I was vlogging and I showed people my coffee mugs and the kind of mugs that I like and people were like, Oh my God, I love mugs. I can talk about mugs all day long. And that was what like, all the comments were. So don't ever be afraid to show the thing. That's what I would say. Like, show the thing that you haven't seen before. Show the thing that you're like, oh my God, like, this is this like, weird little thing that I do. Like, I have like, a mouth guard that I wear at night. Like, I showed it the other day. Like, the, the weirdest thing that, you, that maybe would be like, oh my God, I would never show that to anyone. No one would care about that. They would care. They would care about the mugs. I'm assuming that the whole vlog squad are actual friends. Yeah. Um, <laughs> which is sometimes you can't assume that. Sure. But, no. Yeah. No, um, I get it. What What's it like working with friends, and how do you keep a balance between work and friendship? Because I know that can get kind of muddy sometimes. Um. Uh, well, it's always work first. Okay. You know, like I always, I always, we we th I think of it as work first, and. Um, and I think everyone else thinks of it that way too, because it's not, we're, we're out, when we get in the car to go to Starbucks, mm -hmm. right? we're, we're on the clock, yeah. we're working. I mean, yeah, we're gonna get coffee, but we're definitely working and we're waiting for something to happen or we're trying to make something happen or come up with an idea. Mm -hmm. So it's always about work first and it's always about getting that footage. And then, um, and then there's nights where we go out to dinner and stuff, and no one has cameras. Okay. I was and then, say, and I think, I think like, like that. Time? What is there off time? Yeah. Not really. No. Okay. I mean, there is. There's off time. I think on the weekends, like after, after David posts on like Friday or Saturday, usually like Saturday night, like I don't, I won't bring my camera with me. Okay. We'll all go out. We'll all go do something. Um, but that's a good question. Especially like today and tomorrow, like get your camera and run the camera the entire time. Get as many SD cards. Yeah, I mean, literally run as much as you can and like, just keep, keep trying stuff. Like the great thing about me and my friends is that there's, there's like, no one cares if you fail. Like I fail over, 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 over and over again, but we always try, we always say like, just, just keep trying. There's so many times where I'll stand up and I'll try to make something funny and it's not funny. But like we're always rolling, we're always trying to come up. If you're in the, if you're in the concourse and you see somebody that you know that's like a famous YouTuber or something, like grab the camera and just really politely be like, "Hey, how are you? Could you jump in the vlog really quick?" 
Like, I love when people do that. Like, you know, if, she, if you came up to me with that camera and you were like, oh, can you say hi to the blog? I love it. Like, yeah, I, I want to talk to bloggers. I want to talk to people that YouTube. It's like we're all the same, you know. Are you, uh, here on behalf of my stepmom, who's a YouTuber. Oh, uh, what's her name? Uh, Christina Vandal. Okay. Um, she, I know one of her goals is to try to hit at least half a mil this year. Okay, what does she do? Uh, she, she, <laughs> this is actually kind of funny. Uh, she went to prison a long time ago. Oh, so no she kidding. makes a lot of videos about like prison. Nice. Um, yeah, so she That makes, sounds great. Yeah, yeah, it's really Where funny. is she? Uh, she, she's, um, I think she's upstairs, uh... That'd be great morning. for Jeff. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so great. I have nothing. I barely got a pass. <laughs> People are like, I got, a, I got this intense meeting with <laughs> TMZ. <laughs> I love when you screw up, Jonah, you say things with such pride. You're like, I lost my passport. People are like, oh, what's your plan today? I got no. All right, I came here, barely sneaked myself in. <laughs> and I'm like, dude, absolutely bad. Yeah, but that's fun to do nothing. <clears throat> Don't you think? Well, I want to so, do cool things. I, just, I know. I think you should do one for the camera. They have this at, um, at the farmer's market in L.A. They have a whole store that just does this. And what do you put? Coffee in it or you milk? Put milk? Coffee, milk. No, whatever you want. Right? And then you eat this. <laughs> John, I can't. It looks so good. Okay, Jonah. Yeah. What do you have here? Are one of the tastiest things, dude. Really? I've had in a long time. I mean, I had it last year, though. But I remember the taste. Do you eat the cookie? Yeah, I eat the cup afterwards. You do? I mean, I eat most cups after. You know, <laughs> finish, finish okay, let's see. What do you have in there? So you gotta... Let me take a look. Okay, what's in there? So you have to drink the espresso out of it, and just you slowly eat the cup. So it's like... <laughs> this is so <laughs> No, 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 not that, not that. Jonah, not the plate. You don't eat the plate. Jonah! Okay, guys, this is the fashion section of VidCon 2019. I have a feature creator pass, so that allows me to get this jacket. Girls here think that this is going to look good on me, so we're going to find out. I also got the large. I should have got the extra large. Yeah. They said it runs big. This is bad. You just don't run by the inch. Just like don't buy it. Don't buy it. Yeah. I should have got the XL. Yeah. Damn it. But it looks good though. What up? I'm here with main master Jeff. What's up, guys? We got Kristen in the house back there. And then me behind the camera cutting stuff out. Yeah, this is not going to even make it into the vlog. <laughs> We've been asked to come on stage. Ask Scott's manager, Brandon. Joe is escorting my mother. Do they rub the turf? Yes, absolutely. Yeah, it'll be really funny if you come up. I, th I had this like grand idea that I could like get up into the pit a little bit. Yeah. Because like, no one knows me. Right. <laughs> Pictures, one after another. Really? I think, like, they don't know who I am, I'm but they're like, guy. I'll figure it out later. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's what we were saying. Like, just jump. People will catch you. Should I go with? Yeah, let's go. Liza! I'm sure this came through my birthday, too. We survived and it kicked back. Hey, we're live for the kickback. What's up, what's up? Make some noise! 